One thing I want I want to address, something that's important to me, and I believe it's important to, to link to because I know you guys have talked about it, but the accredited investor rules need to change. We have to be able to give more access to regular people. I didn't become, I'm an accredited investor today, but I wasn't an accredited investor until I'm in my 40s, okay? And that's a fact. I'm from a single mom, grew up on welfare and food stamps in Detroit. I wasn't born into money or anything like that. I served in the military. I can assure you that my eight years in the Marine Corps, I didn't qualify for an accredited investor. Imagine someone serving in the their military for 20 years. They don't have, they don't make, 250000 a year. They don't have a million dollars in, in net worth. And so they can't meet those guidelines. And so that's something that needs to change. Obviously, getting access to quality companies in a pre-IPO environment, something that I always wanted to do. And so linked to just when I've learned of it, I just said, let me check this out. The convenience with Uphold and that relationship that link to developed with Uphold, it was just too convenient for me, right? I'm an XRP holder. And as soon as you guys are like, hey, you know, you can use some of your XRP to buy Ripple. You can use some of your XRP to buy Uphold. You can use some of your XRP to buy Bitru or or, or uh, some of the other companies that I invested in. For me, I'm a, I'm stupid when it comes to technology, right? I'm a, No, I'm being honest. I, I'm a moron. I have to get my office here because the Zoom's not working right. <laughs> so when something is easy for me to do technologically and it's a user experience is very friendly, that was a big part for me. And so I'm one of these guys, like, again, I don't get paid by link to, I don't get paid by Uphold. I don't get paid by Ripple. I don't get paid by anybody. I just tell the truth. So the truth is I'm a customer. The truth is I've invested significant funds in the platform to gain access to these pre-IPO shares. Should say for all sake of disclosure, because I believe in disclosures, I did receive a nice, Christmas present from Link2. Like it was a bottle of champagne and a wine, not for me, but for their, their customers. And so I uh, thank you.